What's up guys? Going for the Jordan Retro 5 Bel Airs right now. Also the Kith Coca-Cola sneakers, the Converse ones. The main goal for today is to get as many Bel Airs as possible on Toru. Obviously it does very well on foot sight, so everything is set up on there. Just gonna make sure that it runs smoothly. I don't have to really pay too much attention to it. I just, as long as I have my test set up, I press go. Everything's already set up right now, so everything should be pretty good. The one thing that I really want to focus on is Kith, and it's not like these Converse's have a crazy amount of profit or anything like that. I just want to be able to really use my Balco bot successfully. Uh, I've been testing it out this past week. I tried it for or the Kith uh, Coca-Cola truck. I also went for the A6 as well that came out on Kit, and I was unsuccessful for both. So hopefully I can get this bot to start working towards my favor. I definitely learned a lot about my mistakes and things that I need to correct, but I still feel like it might take a little bit to actually get it down. So we'll see how I do today and hopefully I can finally get Shopify under my belt because it is very annoying. I mean, I've been using Fatty A and Flow, which are two really good Chrome extensions, and um, that's actually been helping a lot for Shopify. I might be able to check out a few things. But I want to be able to use Balcobot to its fullest potential. I know that it's very good on Shopify, so I need to take advantage of that. Finally, one adult size is submitting checkout. Yes, finally one coming through. So we got one kid size, one GS size. I'm just gonna let it keep running. Nice, I got a bunch more submitting checkout. This looks nice. Another men's. This is looking to be a pretty decent drop. So apparently Kip didn't drop, maybe it's dropping at 11, I'm gonna have to double check that. So far, so we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, we got 8 pairs with 3 of those being the GS sizes. So 5 adult, 3 GS, not too bad, obviously I want to keep going. Did pretty well. I was able to get about six to eight adult sizes, and I got a lot of the GS sizes. I got probably about 20 of them, and it's not bad because I have a buyer set up to buy them. However, there are some problems that I'm running into the limit on some of my credit cards and some of my privacy cards, and so. Even though I know I'm going to get that capital back eventually, like a lot of my capital is locked up. Um, I have about a couple thousand dollars worth of shoes at Stadium Goods that still needs to be sold on there. Uh, I got a bunch of the Bel Airs and the GS sizes are not the most profitable. I'm probably going to make very, very little money on those. So it was a huge investment to get very little back and so now I need to be a little bit smarter about just saving up some capital and making sure that I have enough to buy the stuff that I really need 
that are going to give me a better return. So today is the Supreme Drop and uh, it's the first week of the Fall Winter Supreme line. And there's some hype items coming out. We have the Verify Tee, which I'm going to get a few of those. And um, I'm going to get a sling bag personal for myself. And we also have the Smurfs jacket. Now, I'm not a big fan of the Smurfs jacket. I'm not a huge fan of the Smurfs in general, but it seems like it has pretty good resale value. And the Verify Tee, I think the Verify Tee is super funny because anyone who tries to buy anything off the Supreme, Everyone knows that the CAPTCHA is the most annoying part, so the fact that they actually came out with a t-shirt with the Verify tee, and it's also like a nod to botters as well because they know that everyone is trying to solve these CAPTCHAs to get their stuff, so it's pretty funny of them to do that. I think it's pretty hilarious that they did that. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna try to get a few of the Verify tees. We're gonna get one of the Smurf jackets, and we're gonna get one of the sling bags. So, we're not gonna get too much today. I'm not running a bunch of tasks. I'm running probably like eight to nine tasks today. And uh, I'm only, only running Toru. I know Balco, the Supreme is not doing very well on there. However, there was an announcement just recently that they are doing a huge overhaul and a big update for Supreme. So maybe it'll be better in the future. Um, I'm not really that much of a Supreme person anyways. I know I can make a little bit of money off of them. Right now, I'm just trying to focus mainly on sneakers. A few personal items I want as well, so we're definitely gonna go for a few of them during this drop. Okay, let's see how we do. Getting all these failed payments. I don't know why. Looks like I got one. Got one black tee. Seems like only I should have looked at this earlier. Oh man, I should have looked at this earlier. Uh, the, the, everything that's getting through is safe mode, and most of my tasks were. Most of my tasks were not safe. Uh, they were fast mode. Which, uh, I mean, hopefully we'll catch some restocks, but I was able to get my personal black sling, so that's cool. I got one black verified tee so far and a sling bag. Not too bad. We're still at kind of a loss because I'm honestly, these are two good personals. Like, I could definitely. Uh, I guess the t-shirt is a large, I might be able to sell that. But I can rock both of these easily. But that's kind of a waste of money, so maybe I should sell it, I don't know. I'll decide when I get it in hand. But if I get it hit more than one, then I can resell it and make more money, you know? Yo, thank you guys so much for continuing to support the channel. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And this coming week, I got a bunch of shoes, and you'll find out what I got on the next episode.